Hello guys, I have to cut off the beginning part of this video, probably won't, but today I want to show you guys how to make blue from Jurassic Park and Feather Family, because I've noticed with the update of the new bird, a lot of people joining private servers, they want to make blue, but a lot of them put like barely any effort into it. First things first, the newest bird here, the Dromosaurus, if the game will also kindly load it, thank you. This is the best bird to use because that black stripe along its back makes perfect for the stripe that blue has. I'm not going to pull up an image because I don't feel like going on Google to find one. But yeah, that black stripe makes perfect for blue's little stripe, blue stripe along her back. Now, I already made a blue OC. You could use their textures if you want, but it basically looks like this. And as you can see, I have like little white stripe added along, which really um, blue also has. So that's what makes it even more realistic. And I'm going to be showing you guys how you guys could do that. I um, And I'll also show you the best textures to use. So, eye colors of your choice, but I would use light blue. Then, I will go here and make the beat the darkest shade. Head to advanced colors, click copy, and then paste it to all the others. I find, I find this way easier to do than just spending time going through the entire thing, hand by hand, customizing it. I could just do something as simple as this. Mmm, a little too dark. I think I'm going to switch colors. I'm going to skip this part. Also, before I skip it, I think if you want a lighter shade, and you can just use the second one. But either of these two, I'm going to use the second one. Okay, now that that's done, we're going to scroll on down. Chest. Since we use like this light, I will go here. And make the chest a little bit lighter. But that's my opinion. Some people like to keep it the same color. You don't have to customize any of that. Talons. You could make white. Or you could make them black. I would prefer to do it black. Though that means that the teeth will also be black. So maybe I'll go for a light gray. And then extra, which is the stripe along its back, we would make the darkest shade of blue. Now that kind of looks like blue, except it don't have her iconic white stripe. So we'd head to patterns, and this pattern right here. Oops, my bad. Almost forgot. You gotta head to advanced markings, scroll all the way down, and then here. The extra you would add that pattern. Did I, did I add a pattern to something? Oh god, give me a second. Okay, now that you have that pattern, you could go and make it white. And there you go, you got blue's white stripe. Now, if you really want to add character, then you could use. I would say this one to make a nice work scale look. And as some people already know, the beak and the feet and talons, it, you could just head here and then add that scale look to it. Or you could even make it a different pattern like that. Yeah, it's pretty um pretty cool trick to making raptors and other type of dinosaurs. Yeah, I. That's it for now. But yeah, that's how you make blue from Jurassic Park. I hope this video has been helpful. And before I sign off, I'm going to show you guys what it looks like. I already had my name customized. I don't know what's going on in that chat. We're, we're, we're going to get rid of that. Okay. Yeah. Sadly, this bird can't fly. It would be really cool if it could fly. But yeah, very fast. A great for role plays. Oh, and also, if you actually made it this far, I want to let you guys know 
that I have a private server now. So if you wanted, and if you could head to private servers, and I'll probably host one. Not the multiverse, but yeah. I'm not going to host a private server right now, but yeah. Oh, look. There goes a drama store. Like me. Just existing. Okay, I guess they're dancing. I'm going to go. Yeah, that's it for now. Goodbye. Blue from Jurassic Park signing off. Hey, hey, hey. No, get out of here.